Greetings, this is Darvain and welcome back to Let's Play UFO Aftershock. Okay, another batch of recording. I don't normally talk through these, as you may have noticed. But it's a new batch of recording. And I've been having some rather interesting conversations. That's a capture, okay. I know. We need enough uh, human, okay. Just get the team prepared and then we can sort out what's going on. Hey, welcome back, Nancy. Medic leader and a trooper. Uh, huh? Rocket launchers and related weapons. Mm. Fortunately, we can't exactly put. I don't, know if I, I don't think we can have an under barrel grenade launcher on a submachine gun. I don't think so, no. That makes sense. Hmm. Oh well, never mind. That said, I think you can have a grenade launcher. There you go, grenade launcher in case you ever need to. Love a grenade. In fact, we'll put some extra ammo in the backpack. There we go. Have a let's have a rethink of this. Uh, let's get rid of that. Machine gun. Yes, let's compose you now. Right, well. Is that a cult? We can have an Uzi. Or an SMG. Let's go 9mm. Okay. Well, Rangers have close combat and can be amb an ambidextrous. And we've seen what they're like with um, commando equipment, so sort of makes sense rather than to use an air gun which uses throwing so superhero plus one Mm-hmm. 
do 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 Okay. Launch the mission. Okay, as I was saying, we have had some interesting conversations. I mean, at the time of recording, I mean, this is going to be. This is scheduled for the middle of January. Well, nearly, more near the end, actually. Although I'm recording this at the beginning of November. Just prior to the launch of Hammerting, believe it or not. So I've just been having some interesting conversations with uh, Warp Zone. I keep saying, wanting to say Warp Stone. That's the uh, Warhammer Fantasy fanzine in me, but yeah, Warp Zone devs about the launch of Hammerting and basically their post launch strategy going forward. Anyone who knows this channel will know the part of the fun experiences that I had with Evil Genius 2. So, which was, I mean, that was a disappointing launch for a disappointing product, but most importantly, it was badly handled. Orders, Commander. By Rebellion, who seemed to go Awaiting with command. an arrogance about an arrogance about awaiting command. The assumption that Off fans will automatically like how the game is going. Coupled with a lack of information and a kind of wait wait and see kind of policy back that was backed up by shutting down any criticism any way it can. Which left a lot of disgruntled people even further alienated. Ready, sir. Yes, sir. I'm ready. I'm ready. And so, a lot Standing of fans by. who had pre-ordered based on something. the original felt like they'd basically been dismissed and shut out, and had they fran had one of their favourite franchises stolen from them. Awaiting What's instructions. Now. Uh, Hammerting, as we go with a week at this point to go, is in a somewhat rough state, to put it mildly. I publishers rather than developers set release dates. That much we all know. And with the interruptions of COVID, it's been a rough year for a, a small for a small studio, especially a new small newish newish small studio like um, Warp Zone. So there's little reason to assume that the ready, sir. That the uh, command. outcome of the launch will be much different to your orders evil genius 2 i am moving they have the advantage that 
I mean, they do have the advantage that it's not an existing IP, so in terms of expectations, how the game ends up and what they want to do is pretty much up to them. However, it's been on on early access, so not so much for me because um, I got it as part of Humble Choice back like four like four months ago at the time of recording back in July. But for people who have actually paid for early access full price. There, well, there is going to be certain expectations about what the game should be delivering. And yes, sir. The failure I'm to meet ready. those expectations. Off I go. I'm ready. Is going Off to be a I bit go. of an issue. I read. There's no getting Relocated. around that. No matter how you look, yes. at it, there's no getting around that. So yes, sir. To be honest. I'm here. The devs at Hammerting are prob uh, at, warp, on my at way. warp zone are probably best taking it on the chin, as it were, and dealing with that in an open and honest way. Because I mean, it's been a tough year for well, a tough couple of years for everyone, and without a coat, I don't know how much the COVID lockdown impacted Sweden but if it's anything like it was in Britain the time lo the time lost could easily have been a year or more from lockdowns orders commander and that's easily the time awaiting command needed uh, the hammer the hammer feels command. that he needs to become the Jeremy has Standing potential by. to be ready sir Right, here we go. Yes, I here know. I go. I mean, I've done a Let's Play for this channel, which is, at the time of recording, seems to be quite popular. By my channel standards, anyway. And I was fairly impressed with that. Uh, although, but the that Let's Play is due to end just before launch. I mean, a couple of days have Look, left over there. based on recording. I'm ready. Just deal with this. I am moving. Yes, sir. And the sheer amount of improvement. Yes, sir. I read. That has taken place I'm here. in the past four months of development are coming up to launch. I've shown just how much the game has changed and improved from how it was. And that which we didn't have the war, which didn't have a major feature in it, which was the overground war that the that he originally released with, and a lot of people bought it for. So, Engaging enemy. Done. What's next? Heading out. Okay. Negative. Really? You killed him? You didn't have to critical hit that. That's disappointing. Oh, that's not the one we wanted. Brilliant. That's even better then. 
Think we'll tidy up. I'm ready. Orders, Commander. Orders, Commander. And carry on. Anyway. Standing by. Bit roughly, I mean trying to do multitasking has never been my strong point. Task completed. But yeah. Yes, sir. Right. Here we go. Awaiting new orders. Like I said, it's quite clear that with the year, at the current rate, and what they want to do. If they'd have got that extra time, the game would have, would have been a lot better. Awaiting new and orders. in terms of, we can't change the past, but in terms of going forward, the closest thing that you can get to getting that Ready, time sir. back is probably a robust post-launch schedule. You know, yes, sir. switching to the idea of games as a service and following right. kind of Here we go. Uh, an a update cycle command. that's a bit like Paralo Paradox Design Studios. Your orders, off I go. I, I mean, read. certain parallels in that in various fields. Yes. That's yes, sir. Heading out. Cer certainly warrants it, and there's certainly the scope within Hammeting itself to support that type of development. Awaiting instructions. I'm done. So, I mean, there's been a bit the, the discussion that I've been having on Discord, in Discord mostly. I mean, the same conversations have come up on Steam, but it's basically the importance of managing expectations. Orders, Commander. I'm ready. I am moving. And being open and honest. I'm ready. As a I studio. Standing by. With the fans, because I think the fans are going to have to get on side. You need something? And are going to be important I'll for the launch. Ready, sir. Right. Here we go. Because they will probably become strong brand advocates, as it were, for the for Hammer Ting. Enemy sighted. Yes, sir. Your orders. Targeting. Awaiting command. I read. Yes. Here I go. Orders, Commander. Head now. Targeting enemy. Yes, sir. Attack terminated. Anyway. Yes, sir. Right. Here we go. I'm ready. Off I go. I'm ready. Off I, mean, I go. The discussions that I've had with the devs Orders, Commander. Head on now. Discord. I'm here. I've already shown the dedication that and the passion that they have for Hammerting. Backed up by the experimental updates. So in a way they sort of earned their benefit of the doubt in a way that Rebellion never did. Awaiting command. The problem is Your orders. is that's on Discord. And by the I nature read. of the platform itself. Yes, sir. There's a there can be 
there's a, yes. can be a very different potential on my way. perception on Steam regarding the game and uh, regarding the studio simply because of a lack of presence in the same way that they would have on disc they have on Discord. Well, what do we have here? I'm ready. Mm. Orders, Commander? Yes, sir. Your orders? I'm ready. Copy. I'm here. I read. Target acquired. I'm ready. Awaiting new orders. Look, that over there. Your orders? Done. What's next? Yes, sir. Can't do it. I don't have a shot. Standing by. I'm ready. Ready, sir. Orders, Commander. Your orders. Targeting. Did you crit that one too? You did, you crit that one too. But I know you were going to do it. Anyway. He's annoying, but never mind. Are you going to tell me that you are not? You're going to be stubborn. Bet yeah. Huh? <laughs> Ridiculous. Let's try again, shall we? Anyway, basically, taking my experiences from Evil Genius with uh, my various expertise, if I, if I can call it that. Some interesting discussions about. Ready, sir. Basically, your orders helping to manage awaiting command community over the Hamilton community on Steam over the launch. Off I go. Copy. Relocating. Orders, Commander. I'm here. Yes, sir. So, yeah, been sort of interesting, dis interesting discussion. Awaiting instructions. I mean, the thing with anything like that, it's hard to know without being yes, there specifics. Right. Here we go. I'm ready. So. Off I go. Like organization, I'm ready. And stuff. How big the I team read. is. Repositioning. How they work. Orders, commander. So there's only yes. so much. On my way. You know, but I think if they can, they can take it on the chin. 
maintain a positive presence on Steam so that they uh, humanise themselves and the studio uh, and are uh, open and honest about the state of the game as it is, what needs improving uh, and engage with the engage with the community in a positive way to help provide those who are disappointed with it which there will be some because uh, i mean basically the overworld will, the overworld will there's no way that's going to be finished in a week they are putting the truth of it there's no way that's going to happen but the foundations there Orders, Commander. Your orders? Yes, sir. Your orders? Copy. Ready, sir. Heading out. I'm ready. Yes, sir. Awaiting command. Sorry, don't think I can go that way. I, mean, I know I've had this discussion on Steam several times. I mean, I'm not as invested in Hammer Team because I got it as part of humble, uh, part of humble choice. So for me, I got it yes, sir. as an unexpected part, of, I am moving. a semi-expected part of a subscription service with a whole bunch of games for a price that. I'm ready. I am moving. I already I thought it was reasonable. And what didn't, didn't have any expectations about it whatsoever. But you compare that with people who paid early access on, on the promise of a war. Ready, sir. Right. Awaiting command. Copy. Engaging enemy. Awaiting command. Ready, sir. I'm ready. I'm here. Yes, sir. Targeting enemy. And it's easy to... Well, it's easy to understand why people might be disappointed with the launch. Now, to be honest, I think a lot of what happened with Evil Jinx was not just the disappointment, but the way Rebellion reacted to the disappointment as if... It was the fans that were wrong Awaiting new for their, orders. for such disappointment. That as if they were treating them treating felt like being treated as if the critics had a sense of entitlement Awaiting to their own feelings, you know, their own reactions. And instead of and then being shut out because the de the rebellion just did not want to deal with Spotted a hostile. Any of it. You know? Attack terminated. I'm ready. I read. Target acquired. Orders, Commander? That's not possible. Yes, sir. Targeting enemy. I'm ready. Targeting. Yes. Anyway, if... As long as Warp Zone can avoid doing that. Attack terminated. In fact, as long as they can do the opposite of that, all well and good, really. Hmm. 
ready, sir. I mean, I right. think... Here we go. That? Awaiting command. Your orders? I'm ready. The, from what I've seen of the team, having... Standing by. Dealing with them, Relocating. I think, uh, as, as people and as fans and... And just engaging with them on Discord, they're more than capable of... I've aborted the attack. Um, resolving the issues, if given the time to do so. I see one. Yes, sir. You know? Yes, sir. I read. I Your think orders. that's something that's important orders, to... Orders, Commander. Head now. Stress. I'm ready. Orders, Commander. I've got him. I'm here. Here I go. Attack terminated. I mean, there's a lot of synergy between development uh, in development between. Yes, sir. Uh, video games and tabletop games. Which is what I mostly did. I say did because I'm not actively designing anything at the moment. So. Your orders. Oh well. Off I go. Standing by. Yes, sir. Targeting enemy. Yes. Enemy sighted. Where? Where is this other enemy? Over there, right. I'm ready. No way. Ready, sir. Right. Here we go. I'm ready. Attacking. You need something? I see him. Uh. I see one. Awaiting command. Awaiting command. I read. Yes. Orders, Commander. I'm ready. I mean, it also feels like Targeting. there's a big part of, well. Yes, sir. I think the same would be teaching my grandmother to suck eggs. Yes, sir. I. They're a development studio, they should already, they should probably already know all this. But in I'm saying ready. that, like I said, there is a lot of synergy between tabletop and video games development. But... Ready, sir. No problem. Your orders? I tabletop is yes, more sir. more informational. Right. Here we go. In its nature. So Head now. It's more used to dealing with 
so as an industry it's more used to dealing with their written words so the idea of here they come information ready sir and writing things down and engaging and I'm is ready. much more of a natural process in a way copy Engaging enemy. I can't get there. What's next? Orders, Commander? Sure. I've got to stop my attack. And He's gone. Because, uh, I mean, a big part of anything with writing it is once you get the information down, it's down and you can do whatever. I mean, it's all part of the content waterfall, which was an idea that was, well, I don't know if it was coined, but I learned it from John 4. Done. What's next? Right. Here we go. Back in the day, as it were. And it's Your like, orders, Commander? Once you've got the information down, you can repurpose that to other things like dev diary or forum posts or this or that. Indeed, the hardest thing with it with like the content more for is usually the fact that it's the information that you don't produce naturally that becomes a problem. And if you're not used to writing stuff down, then writing the content for dev diaries is an issue. You know, if you're not doing artwork for your design, then doing artwork for your for your posts or whatever are go is going to be difficult. Yeah, so it's been in, it's it's been an interesting discussion. It'll, it'll be good to see what's going on. I mean, for me and anyone interested in this channel, I mean, I'll probably do. I most likely will do at least one other let's play of Hammerting, just to show you how much it's changed since the version I was doing as the let's play. I think it was version 7. Anyway. Okay, this... Anyway, it's enough waffling for this one. I've waffled pretty much through this, which is unusual for me. Um, this has been Darvain and doing a Let's Play UFO Aftershock. If you like what you're seeing here, be sure to like, subscribe, share and comment. Please consider sponsoring me on Patreon. And until next time... Goodbye.